Hall and welcome to the Gold Zone. Our special guest today is Brittany Collette as we uh, come your way inside of the Corette Athletic Training Center. Uh, just got done working out. It's when we're grabbing everybody. How'd workout go today? It went really well. Today was a good drill. It was change of directions, which every sport needs. So it was good. It was good. Uh, tell us where you're from and how'd you get to San Jose State? <laughs> I'm from Newbury Park in Southern California. Um, I was an unrecruited senior at the time. I kind of got on late and then Coach Choate was here at the mm -hmm. time, and he recruited me, and he offered me right on spot. And I kind of thought San Jose, I didn't know much about it. And I was like, okay, I'll give it a shot. Came up here and just loved it, loved it. I came up here. We're talking to some of the student athletes from the L.A. area, and uh, what are the differences between Southern California and Northern California that you've noticed? The driving. Oh, gosh. <laughs> people up here don't know how to merge. No, but then again, like, the people up here are much more nice. It's not as fast-paced as, like, in L.A. and stuff where everybody's on their own schedule and their time is more important than your time. So that's good. That's how about good. life as a, uh, a student athlete? Are you enjoying college uh, time when you're, when you're not playing volleyball or working out? Uh, what are some of the things you do? Um, when I'm not, honestly, that's the majority of my that's time it. I shot, but I think it keeps me focused, so that's good. That's really good. Between sports and school, I don't really have much time to get in trouble, so <laughs> it keeps me in line. Are you a fan of any other sports other than volleyball? My brother's a baseball player, so I like baseball. really like baseball. Do you have a favorite baseball team? Um, he's with Detroit, so I'm a fan of Detroit. Your brother plays for in the Detroit system? Mm -hmm. He's in the minor leagues. So. What, what level is he at? He's in high A right now. Okay. What, a, what did he? Uh, what was his route to becoming a professional baseball player? He signed right out of high school. He was supposed to go to Fresno State. Thank God he didn't, or else <laughs> we'd have bad blood in the family. Uh, any role models that you have had growing up? My parents. My parents are my best friends, and they just taught me the everything I. No, they made me the person I am, and I really look up to both of them. What's your major, and what do you plan on doing after college? I'm an English major, and I want to go to law school and work with like a sports agency. Okay. Do the contracts. But it's a, uh, it, I guess it would be business law. Yes, that is it sports really management. Is there? Can you um, go somewhere and actually target becoming uh, working with uh, uh, athletes? It would probably be contract law, and then just hook up, go and intern with a sports agency, and see where that takes me. I'm not, I'm not sure quite the path. Yet, <laughs> got two more years. When you rent a DVD or go to the movies, what kind of movies do you watch? Comedy, gotta have comedy. I love comedy. Um, and then also your movies like Remember the Titans and those sappy ones, but sappy sports movies that'll jerk the tears out of you, but definitely comedy, love to laugh. Do you have a favorite comedy movie? Um, love Ace Ventura, I can watch it all the time. Like Blue Collar Comedy Tour with them. Just anything funny. So uh, Jim Carrey, is he your oh, favorite actor? By far. By far. <laughs> yes. <laughs> what about in your iPod? What do you listen to when you uh, listen to music? Um, before games, it's a lot of hip-hop stuff to just make me, like, get amped and stuff. Love classic rock. And then, gosh, um, Jack Johnson. like Jack Johnson a lot. You seem like you're kind of a high-energy person. Is, yeah. is that, does that fit you a little bit? Yeah. yeah. I mean, once you're up, just get going. Just get going. <laughs> Yeah, I like I can mellow out and stuff and just sit back and relax, but I like to always be doing something. What are, what's maybe something about you that, that maybe your friends don't know or some people don't know about you? Oh, gosh. I'm so open. I mean, they know everything. Um, they don't. I get really shy around, like, people that I don't know right away, and that's kind of something where people are like, are you serious? I'm like, yeah, I get really shy. If I don't know the situation and stuff, I'll be really quiet, but then once I'm going you can't stop me that's <laughs> great. That's great. That, you do any reading in your off time a little bit what, what, what kind a of books bit. do you like to read I like they call me coach by John Wooden okay. that's one of my favorite books right now if you are surfing the web do you have any uh, internet sites that you stop by daily YouTube I'm a YouTube fan I like watching the, the people try to dance on YouTube it's one of my favorites Jason, you excited about this coming fall super excited with the new coach and the team that we have and the girls coming in it's gonna be it's gonna be good we're gonna be very good Kind of camaraderie. Is this team pretty close? Uh, I know that, again, it's, it's kind of awkward having the new coach come in in the middle of your tenure, but uh, is this close? Uh, is the team going to be pretty close? We are so close. It's one of those things where, like, we'll get on each other, but as soon as an outsider comes to get on us, you're through. We will all jump on you and we will heckle you, but we are super close. We will do anything for one another. Do you do it? <laughs> oh, that's great. We appreciate your time. Thanks Thank for joining us. Thank you so us. much.